Hey. Okay. Hey, y'all. So, I wanted to come live because it's one of them nights. And I'm on my iPad, y'all. I'm on my iPad, so y'all are really going to be able I cannot. I ain't going to say I'm really going to be, but y'all can really see me, right? So, I'm about to tie my hair up first, and I'm going to tell y'all what I'm about to do right now. And it's relating to my pen message. My pen message. It's related to my pen message. So, whoever can guess what I'm about to do tonight regarding that pen message, I'm going to let you know if you read or not. Cancun. Hey, hey. Thank you for buying the badge, Ashley. Bestie, let's, let's see the pit. Child, this is a big fit. Don't flatter me now. What you about to do? You about to hat. Aha! Come on, Michaela. Yes, Michaela gets it first. I'm about to pack for y'all. Mm-hmm. So whoever in here is gonna be able to see the first outfit. The first outfit. The first, I'm gonna say the first outfit, but the first up close and personal before it hits the ground, right? So I'm excited. So y'all know I'm rocking my hair. Y'all know black girl magic teams, right? Hey girl, hey. Thank you, Denise, for buying a badge. Thank you, Makita, Makita, Makita for buying a badge. I'm sorry if I pronounced your name wrong. Your smile is so pretty. Thank you. Don't flatter me. Thank you. I appreciate it. I'm going to purr. You look good, boo. Thank you. So pretty. Thank you. Pack. Mm -hmm. Oh my gosh. Thank you, 9113. She bought three badges, y'all. Much love. Teeth on extra white. Okay, get into it. It's giving veneers. And it's not even that. Uh-huh. Child, you making any more music, y'all? I'm done with music. I don't like music. I tried it a few times. It just don't. It doesn't spark my it doesn't spark my interest. Oh, you going. Look rub. Excuse me. I look cute. It's the go for me. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. Oh, you look so happy. I do. Yanni Dubai. Thank you for buying a badge, boo. Um, for your birthday to Cancun, are you wearing your raw hair? Mm-mm. You know I ain't doing that. I'm getting some braids like I always do because I'm going to be in the ocean and stuff. Thank you, Amari, for buying a badge. You reached 10 supporters. Thank y'all for buying a badge. How was your day? It was hella good. It was real um, eventful. Me and Bay went all over the world for real though. Thank you, Shawnee X. Thank you, Essence, for buying a badge, both of y'all. Okay. Now we got to get this. What's the name on her? Baby. I brought my tea up here. Yeah. Huh. Okay, hold on, y'all. This is the concentration. You reach. Oh. Thank you, Rihanna, for buying a badge. Thank you, Pressure Can't Talk, for buying a badge. I appreciate y'all for real. Much love. Okay. 21, 22 shots. Thank you for buying a badge, boo. I'm sorry, y'all. It's gonna get a little ratchet now. It's gonna get a little ratchet. Thank you, Supernova, for buying the badge. Thank you, Shots Top, for buying another badge. Y'all showing me love tonight. Uh oh. Hold on. I'm gonna put it over my ears. Yeah. Okay. Okay, y'all. Mm. Thank you, self made joint for buying a bitch. Mm -hmm. Yeah. 
I've been having this little cold, y'all. I thought I had corona a third time, child. My nose been running. All right, so let's get into this. Hold on, baby. Yeah. Can you open this, please? Both of these. Thank you, thank you. Drink my little tea. Okay, so I'm about to pack. So whoever on here. Y'all are going to be able to um, see your girl's outfits before it hits the ground on my birthday week. And that's a good thing. Thank you, Jayla, for buying a badge. Okay, let's get into the room, right? So, y'all, this is how ready I am for Cancun. It don't make no sense. And I always say I'm going to show my room in my little next fully furnished apartment tour. But, child... Y'all done seen my whole room already now. And I'm about to put y'all down on this thing. And let me know if y'all can still hear me or not. Oops. Oh my God. Thank you, baby. Hold up. Yeah, I'm trying to set y'all up properly so y'all can get into it. But you might be in it. Just let me know. Take my little pills. Drink my little tea. Oh, okay. I'm about to bag it. So, like half of my clothes and stuff came already that I um that I bought online. I'm gonna put y'all right here. So I'm happy about that. Baby, do you mind going and get my suitcase, please? Where is that? Huh? It's in my um, my film room. I'm sorry. I know you're comfortable. Okay. So first things first, I got this um um waterproof phone case because I'm gonna be in the water with it, and I'm gonna get my little ring light on. I'm going to either cut my light on or my ring light. I'll be trying to save on the light bill, so I'll be cutting my little LED lights on. Let me see how this looks. It's not giving what it's supposed. So, I'm going to go get my ring lights. Ooh. Oh, what's true? Okay. I'm going to put y'all up. Right here. First things first. Thank you, baby. First things first. I got this little waterproof phone case, y'all. I know, right? I'm that extra. Huh? Thank you, baby. Got this. And I bought Bay one, too. Bay, see if it fits your phone real quick. See if I got to buy another one. That. And I bought... Oh, Y'all not ready for this. This is my favorite one. Well, not my favorite, but... The coolest item I bought. Dang, I'm trying to go to Cancun. I'm dead. Hey, Drayton. So, wait, you want the people that take off the clothes every time they lay in the bed? What What if they just want to choose? But, yeah. This bag, right? But this isn't just any old ordinary bag, baby. Look inside of it, though. Because y'all know I'm going to be beating my face in Cancun. Baby, but that's not all. Look. Oh, that's not all. Look. Oh, ain't that crafty? Mm, it's crafty. Super crafty. So, it got all these tucks and pockets. I could put, like, my um, perfume in there. Um, I'm loving the happy girl. Thank you, Drayton. 
girl no you don't chill in the bed with day clothes and who raised y'all jeans these ignore the comments if you know why you ever look at the comments bro? i'm sorry i'm trying to show y'all something what y'all say what y'all talking about oh where you got it amazon everything i'm about to show y'all is 99 percent amazon so this yeah <laughs> and it's big it's the large one because they had a small one but i'm like oh no baby i want to be extra and i close it up and it's a little zipper so i'm gonna put that um like my makeup and stuff in it and i got these swim caps because girl i'm not getting my hair hair wet even though I'm getting, I even though I'm getting braids, I'm still not getting my hair wet. Mm -mm. Can't even do it, baby. Oh, here it go, y'all. Now this right here, I got my retainers on, so it's not gonna open, baby. Can you open this, please? Baby opening everything for me. Y'all be feeling handicapped around him, girl. Um, never talk, never take all your makeup. TSA mistreats your stuff, but careful take everything. Oh, baby, that's going on a carry on. Uh huh. Yeah, I know. Makeup expensive. Thank you. Thank you, girl. I know makeup expensive, honey. Uh uh. It's carry on. Uh huh. Why people keep asking if I'm pregnant? That's rude. I'm not pregnant. At least I don't think I am. No, I'm not. Thank you. Ha! Y'all saw his face. Oh, y'all can't even see him. <laughs> Why throwing stuff at me? I don't think I am. I don't know. I don't. I don't. I don't. Last time I checked, I wasn't. But, but you don't know. You do know. I don't. How I know? <laughs> How can anybody know if they? Honestly, I know. Fuck you, talking. Yeah, well, he know. I'm pregnant. Mm -hmm. Don't say that. Speaking it up in the existence. Don't say that. So I got this little thing, thing. Anywho, got this little thing, thing. Oh, go in a little bathing suit. Mm hmm. Right. Then you could put it in a little bow. Put in a little bow. <laughs> Y'all laughing. He crazy. You catch a cold when you pregnant. Okay. <laughs> okay. See? Now y'all just giving me the Google symptoms. Okay. Yeah. So this the little uh 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 be on a little beach. Be like, oh, oh, oh. Right? Boom. That's the black one. Cute. And <laughs> And I got a white one. A white one. Yep. So I'm gonna pack that up. And um baby, where can I have put my fashion over stuff? Oh, I see it. Y'all, we went shopping today. When I said we went shopping, we went shopping, shopping. For real, then we babe. We went shopping all this week for Cancun. show y'all my fashion over stuff so this is giving um what's the name this is giving um airport flow mm -hmm. it's giving airport flow these with the little jacket mm-hmm <laughs> the little jacket and it come with a little brizzle 
Mm-hmm. Come with a little bruise or whatever. So this is gonna give airport for sure. Have my little jacket. And I don't know if I'm gonna wear this or not, y'all. Cause Bay said this is giving Miami 2020. And I don't know what's that about. He said it's giving Miami 2020. And I thought it was cute. It's a little cover up for the little bathing suit. I thought it was cute and it hugged my curves real well. But I guess not. So I might not wear it. Because I kind of saw what he was saying. He was like, every bitch on the beach was wearing that. You don't need to wear that. It's not giving. What you say? It's not giving, babe. You said it's not giving bad what? Yeah. It's not giving what? I ain't going to say what it gives because somebody probably was wearing that motherfucker. No, I'm saying. You said. No, you said. Don't wear it because it's not giving bad what? Bad bitch. What you say? It, it ain't. It ain't showing you a bad bitch. You didn't say that. I said it ain't showing. You said bad bitch can't come. Say it. How you said? You said it's not giving. Stop acting like you know. You said it's not giving. Say the whole thing. I said it ain't showing you a bad bitch in Cancun. Okay. (laughs) Book clothes. (laughs) (laughs) He said it's not giving bad bitch in Cancun. I was gonna have my little um my little um bathing suit under it, but. He says I'm giving bad bitch again, cool. So I guess I ain't gonna wear it. So I'm gonna probably find another what's the name for it then? Cause I ain't gonna lie, it is giving bad bitch. It is giving all my friends like it's giving like hot girl summer 2020. You know, it's not giving what it gave on the site, and y'all know what I mean by that. Y'all, I bought this dress like two months ago just for this moment, right? So, I don't know, just giving, mm, going to brunch, you know? And I'm going to have a little cute little slides with it. So, I'm going to pack this. And my little slides, I'm going to show y'all the slides too. Y'all, these slides go exactly, how long, y'all? I think it's inside out. No, it's not. It's not. Is it? Let me see. Oh, it is inside out, girl. Let me flip it so y'all can get into it for real now. Mm Mm-hmm. I don't even know if I want to try, if I'm doing it. So, I got clothes on under these, as you guys can see, so. Boom. Gonna have a titty side. <laughs> Gonna have a cleavage and a cut. You know what I mean? Had a cleavage. Giving the girls, hot girl, giving the girls, I'm grown in 21. Giving the girls, what we drinking tonight? Giving the girls. Let's go to um get some tea. Let's go get some tea. Let's go get some coffee. Okay. And in the back, got the back, y'all. So y'all know. <laughs> Wait up! I'm so excited! Girl, I'm ready to go. So it's giving back tattoo gonna be out. I don't gotta do all this to show it no more. Back tattoo gonna be out. And then, to make it even better, got a little slit. Come on, baby. And, y'all, it's so crazy because I had these slides for years, y'all. And it's literally the perfect match with these shoes, with this outfit. So.
So, yeah. Got the little slit out. Mm. Girl, let me take it off. But I give the juices. I'm not trying to give the juices. That's why I got my clothes on. So, when I pop out with it on Instagram, I'm going to get the full thing. Okay? Periana. It's hot up in her. Okay. Put this up in there. The shoe. That's the first outfit we're going to pack up. I'm trying to pack up stuff I'm not going to wear for the next two weeks. So, this is one of the outfits. I mean, not outfits. Bathing suits. With the little, what the name, whatever. I'm gonna pack that up. And this the other, not the other outfit, but um, the other bathing suit. It's a whole situation. I want to pop out on Instagram with it up, so I'm not gonna show y'all too much. Babe, when you gonna start packing? What do you mean? When you gonna start packing? I like this. And to make it better, we going um scuba diving. <laughs> so just give me scuba diving. I need to cut all of this stuff out just in case they don't got no scissors there because I don't got my braces no more I don't know about y'all but when I used to have braces and I didn't have no scissors on me I used to like <laughs> it's embarrassing now I used to take my brick bracket and I used to like go over it like it was giving metal mouth for real and I used to like <laughs> and I always said if I ever got kidnapped and the kidnappers walked away. I was going to get it. And I was going to. Well, my braces. Yeah. Mm -hmm. Yeah, so. Brace faces. Brace faces. Y'all got an advantage. Thank you. I am Jazoo for buying a badge, boo. Yeah. Yeah, y'all. So, that's what is very much given. Mm-hmm. Uh huh. It'll work too. Trust me. Put this in there. Um. Yeah, y'all. I think that's all that really came. Oh no, I got. Baby, can you do me a big, big favor? You're going to be mad. But can you please lace my vans so I can pack them up, please, baby? With these, with the string. Look, y'all. And we're going ATV riding. And I'm ATV riding these. I bought these just to ATV riding, child. Hmm. And babe, do it real cute how you be doing your Jordans. Okay. So I'm going to pat them up. And this is outfit that I bought that I want to show y'all. Why'd you put good laces in there if you don't? Huh? Lace in? Huh? Why'd you put these laces in there? But it's black. Yeah, That's why. Like, dirty, babe. Babe, I can always wash them in the washing dryer. Well, just keep the black ones in there. Oh, it's black one. Oh, it's black. Oh, it's black. Babe, these laces black. Oh. So I really wasted money. Damn. It don't even look like it fit. 
Oh, yes, you do. You want the looser type. Mm. Or a tight. It's like. Gonna, it's going to have to be tight. Why? Because you don't want them to fall off your feet. Okay. Not tight where they choke you. When you put them on, you have to like, tie them tight. Now, I'm not going to have time to get tight, boy. Yeah, like they flopping off my feet. So, this is the fun part because it's this outfit that I ain't trying on yet. Right. What she when she leave messy first. Um, hello. Stop putting it. <laughs> yeah. Um, yeah. I'm gonna let y'all talk amongst each other. <laughs> so I'm about to try this on. And they gonna let me know if it's cute or not. Where my little shirt that I brought up here? I'll be back. May can you talk to her for a little bit, please? I don't know, yeah. What the hell I got going on tonight? It's Saturday. Y'all at the club and shit. Take a shot for me. Take a shot for me. Oh God, they can hear me. Your mm -hmm. room empty. Y'all, we went to a trampoline jump at the mall, bruh. That shit got me tired. I did like four flips. That shit got me tired, y'all. I did mad flips, y'all. It's on my story if y'all want to see it. Or it's on her story. She tagged me. But yeah. I did like 15 back flips. And I did like four. Nah, I did like eight front flips. I'm so too. But we ain't tripping for real. Yeah, y'all. We pair seven too. Y'all know what that is. Kind of. Yeah. I want to show you. I don't want to show them though. I'm going to. I'll show y'all on Instagrams. Mm -mm. Baby. Can you zip it, please? I just want to see how it looks. And then give me your honest opinion, okay? Like that as a fit? Or yeah. just slides? Nah, I probably was going to wear some heels. Heels? Like some black heels. What you think? Yeah, that's hard. It's cute? Yeah. If you saw me in the street, you'll try to talk to me. On the spot. <laughs> On the spot. Yeah, this is real cute. I like how I put this together. Because you remember that um shirt we see on the mannequin? It yeah. was cute, but this looked cute too. I'm going to show you what heels I'm going to do. I'm going to show you what heels I'm going to do. <clears throat>
state. But if you live in that goddamn state where that hurricane come, get the fuck out quick. Be safe, bro. I know that shit. Man, what shit was better? What the hurricane called? I know y'all know. Let me know. What should it look better? Black. Okay. Yeah, for sure though. Be safe if you in the hurricane, y'all. <laughs> for sure. Okay. What what state? I think it's gonna come through Louisiana. What? Oh yeah, I did see this girl on TikTok in New Orleans talking about it. Shawty said y'all got school tomorrow. Tomorrow's <sighs> Sunday, what the hell? It's Sunday already, technically. Hell. hell no. <laughs> it's ugly? The other one for sure. Okay. You mean? Dang, you just crushed my little style and heart. I'm back. I'm sorry for the delay. I had to do a commercial break to put my little outfit on. It's going to be cute. Had to do a little commercial break. Okay. That's the number two outfit. Ooh, I think I bought this. These to go with the outfit too, y'all. Y'all, it's like when you try to look for something, it just disappeared. Like, what's T? Cool man said, hey girl. Anyway. 
anyway. Um. Yeah. I gotta find it now. So y'all, shirts like these when you be getting them fucking little Chinese boutiques, child, they so iffy. You be like, is this not gonna break while I'm walking, child? Cause, woo. So. So I'm assuming a little cleavage supposed to be out, right? Not a lot of cleavage, just a little cleavage. Oh, okay. It's pretty firm. Hold on, let me see. You gonna see, child. Let me see. be given. I ain't gonna lie, I won't know until I see like this. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Baby, can you hook this up real quick, real fast, real fast? Bend my titties out. You okay? Like tight as you can get it. Thank you. Mm -hmm, y'all. Ain't this like weird? It's I think it's supposed to hang like this, but it's not. Okay, here we go. Let me take this off. Let me see. What y'all think? And it's supposed to like have a little hang. You know what I'm talking about? Like a little, you know? What y'all think? Is it giving a little hang? What y'all think? And I was going to wear. I like it. Okay. The hang is there. And y'all, I'm about to text you with something, China. Okay, boo. Go ahead. My phone over there. Had a little hang. And then I was going to have some leather pants on with some heels. Y'all think that's giving? Trust me. The reason why y'all saying it's, it's, it's in between because my hair, trust me, when I had a makeup on, the full look. It's going to come together. Because I used to do that too. Like, before, like if I was going to go somewhere, maybe like a night before or something like that, I'll literally be like putting on my clothes with my little bonnet on and stuff with no makeup done. And I'll be putting on my clothes and I'll be like, mm -mm, I don't like this outfit. But then when I wake up and put it on with my hair down, it'll look better. Trust me. Trust me. Trust me. Regardless, it's going to be an option. Cause I bought it for Cancun, y'all. I can't just not wear it because of some opinions. But trust me, it's gonna come together. It's gonna come together. Got the little back out. Mm -hmm. What y'all know about the back out? I really want to put these on. I think it's gonna come together.
Oh, that'd be all this junk. All right, okay, here we go. Okay, outfit number two. Let me cut this off too. Y'all, I'm so ready to go to Cancun. Y'all have no idea. Um, show us the whole thing. Mm -mm -mm. I want to pop out on IG, y'all. Mm -mm. Um, it's definitely hot for the leather pants. It's the look, okay? Fashion statement. You know better. Thank you, babe. And it's these. It's like some leather skinnies. And I'm going to um, wear some like black heels or something with it. Okay, y'all. So that's one, two, three outfits. But y'all know how it is, baby. You gotta overpack just in case you wanna change. Here's one thing that I hate, y'all. It's like when you change, not change it, but when you go out of town, you be pack, overpacking just in case, right? But then when you go out of town, you don't even change as often as you think. So you really come home with like three unworn outfits. Like, dang, I thought I was gonna wear it, but you just don't wear it. I don't know why we like that, women. Why are we like that? Oh, yeah, these cute. I like these, y'all. Um, I might not go ATV in them. They too cute to do that. Man. But if I go, like... Okay, so... If I go... When I go ATV in, in these shoes and dirt get on them, it's, like, not going back. Or it's like if you do a little scrub and it'll, it'll be okay. That's so you clean it faster. It won't stain. Because it's like red dirt. The ones I went in ain't still dirty. Huh? The ones like I hella dirty? In, yeah, like some of the dirt stain. Yeah. Mm, which, what about y'all? What y'all think? That's if, if it's like. Or do I have a kind of dirt out there? If it's wet, if it's wet dirt. Oh, like not coming off. I mean, the faster you clean it, if you it'll come off. As soon as it happens, it'll come off. But if you wait, mm hmm. Okay, what y'all think? Have y'all ever like went 18 men or whatever and got dirt on y'all shoe? Was it like real hard to come off or it was just like because I feel like you really can revive any shoe in the world, you know what I'm saying? Especially if you like take it to like a cleaning person that specializes in cleaning shoes. What y'all think? No, don't, don't. Y'all, these are nothing but $60 shoes. I can just go buy some more if they, if they don't. And they really, like, my majority are black. Um, It's called stain because they brand new. Y'all want to um, wear forces. Is there something behind me? Um, they say they easy to clean. That's what I was thinking. That's what I was thinking. I'm going to go ATV in Because I don't even wear my bands like that. So, And if I do get them dirty, I can just wear them for like a, a chill shoe when I go out again. For now, um, of course, I got like some more stuff coming um, from Fashion Nova. Uh, I think I'll order some stuff off of uh, what's it called? Like, 
I think I also I also ordered some stuff off of um, Pretty Little Thing. And I ordered some really cute slides off of Shane. Y'all, is it Shane or Sheen? Let me know. Um, she, Shane is Sheen. Okay. Sheen. Sheen. Okay. Sheen. So not Shane. The way you said it is, it's the second time. Sheen. Okay. Or Sheen. Okay. <laughs> yeah. I say Sheen. Okay, she. Thank y'all for telling me, cause that's important. Da -da -da -da. No. Okay. Um. Anyways, y'all, I'm gonna try this new stuff that I bought today, and I'm gonna go to bed, cause I know that binge is gonna be kicking in soon. So I appreciate y'all. I got 40 badges today. I love, love, love y'all. I really appreciate y'all with well, all my heart for real. Y'all always be coming through with the badges. I don't even be asking y'all. Just be blessing your girl. So, I really appreciate it. I love y'all. And y'all, when I say I can't wait to go to Cancun, baby, I cannot wait to go to Cancun. Like, it's going to be extremely lit. And um, i also been trying to, like, um, kind of, like, move over to body positive postings. I ain't going to say thirst traps, but more just, like, you know, body positive. Um, especially because I'm getting older and stuff. And, like, I be kind of, I ain't going to say I be scared, but... I be kind of like iffy about taking pictures in my um bathing suit and stuff. I don't know why I just always been like that. Even though I work really hard on my body and I love my body, I love myself. But y'all know people can be like real judgmental, especially like due, due to the society. Like a lot of women, they get their body done and stuff. So if you got a little fupa, they think that it's oh you pregnant or oh you bloated or this. It's not. It's like it's not becoming society's norm now. Especially because people get their body, a lot of people get their body done. So I kind of was just like, mm, I don't really want people to see my goodies for real. But yeah, so I can't wait. I'm going to definitely be giving body positive all 21 years old. Um, The whole entire year I'm 21, I'm going to really be popping out. And I'm going to like go into like my feminism and stuff more. Um, And just really show out and show myself for real. <laughs> Um, yeah, so I don't care. And I, it's not about I care what people think, but it's just, you know, I just don't be trying to open that can of worms. I know it don't need to be open, child. Yeah, hey, girl, somebody fine. Please don't get your body done. Stay down to clean. I will as long as I can, unless I have some kids or something. Because word on the street, I'm going to have four kids. So, oh, whatever. Psych, nah. Um, I, I definitely, like, agree to working out. Like, y'all, I'm just so scared to death that... I, I just probably would never get my body done. Like, just knowing, like, it's a high chance of not coming back to life after you on that table. Um, but, y'all, yeah, I love y'all. Thank y'all for the badges again. Y'all always showing love. I love, love, love y'all. Thank you, thank you, thank you. And I'm going to definitely come on live more for y'all. Um, and we stand drama free. Ain't nobody got to, okay? Um, that's why I didn't address a lot of stuff on here as well. Because I know how that stuff started. Because, y'all, i just been blessed. And just really in my own zone. And just, you know, intaking all of these good old blessings. I don't be trying to, you know, get out of my character. Like, recently. Y'all know what I mean. But yeah, I don't, I don't like doing that. Because I always preach about, like, positivity. And I always preach about, like, how, you know, other women should uplift each other. But it's just like. When it's like women bashing other women, 
that you know I look up to or that I really care about or know personally it just kind of bothers me because you don't know nobody's story you know and a lot of times that can be like that person last straw or you know like they last like they last moment to a point they just snap and be like if it um it's over with I'm just gonna kill myself like I know a lot of girls I used to go to school with a lot of girls like that like you never know when somebody you know, in that mode, you don't know what they're going through. They could, they, they probably could have lost everything and could be at a very low point in their life. So, you know, when other people just come and just, you know, be like, well, we got this and you don't got that. It just kind of break my heart because, like, I used to go through that, like, in middle school or whatever. Like, you know, more fortunate girls, you know, because their parents had better jobs. Their parents, you know, had, like, a better lifestyle than my mom did or what my upbringing was, you know. So, um... Yeah, so it's kind of like when other females doing that, I just feel like I got to step in every time. Because it's like, see, what we're not going to do is talk about what this person don't got. Like, you can talk about everything else, but what they don't got, that's not cool. Because God can snatch that jump away really quick. And I'm also like a, um, I'm also like a victim of that. Like, I was so blessed, you know, with such a big platform and, you know, that I have now and it's still growing as we speak. I was just extremely blessed. And one year, I was about 15, 16. This is when I was, like, really coming up on social media. And I think I had hit about 700K. And, you know, I used to talk about people. I was really, like, taking my followers for granted. Um, I thought I was all that in a bag of hot Cheetos. I used to go to school and get into it with girls, you know. Because um, I felt like my platform really spoke for me, you know. So I kind of was just, you know, walking around like my shit don't stink. So, out of nowhere, y'all, I woke up one day and my page was gone, y'all. I'm talking about that was literally my only stream of income. And you talking about a 16-year-old that never got a 9 to 5, don't have any work history, um, you know, wasn't getting money in no other ways except for Instagram. You feel me? At the time, you know, now I have, like, other streams of income and stuff. Um, yeah, so now I got, like, other streams of income and stuff. So, you know, I always, you know, like, walk on eggshells with this platform, but... Yeah, so my page was deleted for almost a year, and I had to go get a job at McDonald's. Um, I'm probably telling a story something about this because it's really like a testimony. Um, yeah, I had to go get a job at McDonald's. That's literally the only job that would hire me because I didn't have like a resume. Um, so I felt like that was a wake up call for me, and my first check was like forty dollars. Wasn't nothing. I couldn't get nothing with that. I think I gave it to my mom to pay my phone bill for that month. So like, when people like, when women do that, or I, I just look at my old self and how I was really, like, just eating up my platform and, you know, not being blessed and, you know, positive with it and not using it for the right things. So, you know, especially when it comes to, like, friends and stuff, you know, and I know their story personally. It's kind of like, mm -mm, see, what we're not going to do is talk about what people got or don't got. You can talk about anything else. You can talk about how they look. I don't care. But... We're not going to talk about, like, what they got and don't. That's not fair. You feel me? I don't really like that. So, um, yeah. And, you know, we all have our differences. I really feel like, y'all, I said I was going to go, and this really just turned into a whole, um, this really just turned into, a, like, a whole ceremony, y'all. Um, yeah. So, yeah. But, you know, I feel like, you know, with this platform, it's, like, a lot of big personalities, like myself and others. So, you know, we all think we just all hell X, Y, and Z. You feel me? Because we work so hard to build the platform that we have. So, sometimes we be feeling ourselves. And that's okay because everybody human. But, yeah. So, I just I just be trying to, like, just share my, share my testimony and just really just let people know. And also, too, like, even people seeing those comments, I'm not going to say it directly. Cause I don't want to turn it into some messy shit. Like, I'm really just trying to like really speak some real shit to y'all, so y'all can live on with this. But um, what I was gonna say? Damn y'all, where I was getting at? What I say y'all? I don't even remember y'all. My head is jumbling up. Um, oh, with y'all, like you feel me? And I also know that some females probably saw the comments or saw the argument and probably felt some type of way. Like damn. I don't got that either, so that that mean I'm less than too. You know what I mean? Trust me, it's some people like that because I got over a million followers, so it's people be swiping up. Like, let's say if I, you know, go shopping or something or get something simple as, 
a purse or an outfit. People be like, dang, like, I wish I can go shop and do in, like you. Or I wish I was as blessed as you to just get up and just have fun and do what I want to do. Or damn, like, I really feel broke now just watching this. People feel like that. And, you know, sometimes you may look at it like, oh, they just saying that. But trust me, people, some some of those people really be looking at it like, damn, like, she doing stuff I'm praying for. You know, so, you know, when you start bragging and boasting, it can kind of get a wrong message. You feel me? It can kind of get a wrong message for other, you know, black females or females in general to be like, well, damn, I don't got that either. So, dang, I'm listening to her. I ain't shit. Now I'm about to go into depression because this girl is living better than me. Because social media likes to portray that. Thank you, um, faithful Marsha. Marsha for buying a badge, boo. But, yeah, so I just, you know, sometimes I just, I just, that moment I just feel like I had to step in because, you know, it's like, even like, I feel, even though I was trying to make light of the situation, even though some people may disagree, but I was trying to make light of the situation. So, in my mind, I'm like, Nah, because I'm pretty sure it's a number of females that seen this comment and was like, damn, well, I don't got that either. So now I feel bad or now I feel like I'm not shit, you know? Um, But yeah, that's neither here nor there. Like, I also had, like, you know, private behind closed doors um, and differences with old girls too. So I, I just felt like at that moment shit we all know each other personally so why not step in and say what i gotta say or to make a lot of the situation on some cool shit but yeah um but y'all don't really want to get into all of that but i really don't like drama and i know a lot of people was dming me that night y'all from the shade room it was like oh my gosh you ate her up i followed you just because of that i was not fucking with that because it's like that's not what i'm about you feel me and i feel like for so very long um um, yeah, for so very long, I, I, I've been positive, you know, I've been staying close to God because every time I get, I used to get into some drama, something bad would happen to me or, um, God would just teach me a small, small lesson that I do not want to go through again. But yeah, y'all, um, yeah, that's, that's really it. So even if it's people in here that came to my page and didn't know who I was before that. So now I want to let y'all know that drama is not what I'm about. I don't really like you know, get into all of that. Like, I try to stay positive as possible and, like, use my platform for good stuff. You feel me? I be trying to lose my use my platform for good stuff. I be trying to use my platform to spread positive words so y'all can talk to my day-to-day -day followers and ask them, what is y'all about? And yeah, they're going to tell you straight up. This girl is very um humble, positive, as much as I can. But, yeah, y'all. I just really wanted to put that out there because I know... Some people was like on my page thinking I was going to talk about it, but mm -mm. I'm no, that's not what I'm about. It was a moment. We all had a moment. So we're not going to get into that. It's okay, period. Anyways, y'all, my room is a hot mess. My room is a hot ass mess. So I love y'all. I'm going to talk to y'all later. I'm going to try to go live more because my, my views and stuff always do good. Or people always be like, oh my God, I'm so happy you live. So I'm gonna live more often. Um, I love y'all. Be safe, stay positive, peace out, girl scouts. The Benadryl's kicking in. Mm-hmm. Mm-hmm.